Hello, hello. Welcome to Bee Cave Public Library. I'm Miss Melissa, and I'm delighted you've joined us today to make a fun holiday card to share with someone you love. Along the way, I'll share some hints for the grown-ups. One of the main ones being to let the artist choose. Grown-ups, we know that sometimes it's tempting to jump in and help your child with a part of the craft, but in this case, there are no right answers. There's no right way for the card to look at the end. There are many choices and lots of opportunities to use creativity and imagination, so we'll want your child to have that full experience. Also, the beauty of crafts, one of them, is that it helps your child with the fine motor development, fine muscle in the hands that will help them hold a pencil and do other tasks like that. All right, so let's begin with just a few simple materials. And those will be cardstock, some pom-poms, a marker, and some glue. All right, the first thing is you'll have to fold your cardstock in half to make the card. Give it a nice firm crease down the edge. Then you'll have to decide, do you want your card to open from the side like this or from the bottom like this? You get to choose. Then I suggest you just have some fun exploring the materials, making a plan before you start to glue. So you might try the pom-poms in different places and see what kind of design that you want to make, how you want things to look. You can also choose a message that you want to write. So have fun with this and try a couple of different things and then you can decide to glue and complete your design. Don't forget to open your card and write a message and sign your name as well. Grown-ups, you might want to add the date to help you remember that this craft is a little snapshot in time of your child's development. Happy holidays to everyone from Bee Cave Public Library.